Hey there, it's Nurgle. Welcome back to this playthrough of Broken Sword Shadow of the Templars. Where do we leave off? Well, the mystery has taken us to Syria. Not present day Syria, that would be very dangerous indeed. No, uh, Syria of the late 90s. Mid 90s? Late 90s? That era. So let's continue. Okay, so I was blurping around here last time, and let me go back in here, and because I think I missed something. So let's, because I feel like I missed something specifically with has to do with this. This is important, because when the, they... Damn, the door's locked. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry? Did, did you say something? He say you not to go in toilet. Read sign, matey. Matey? It lose something in translation. Fair enough. Okay, so read this. Okay, so read the sign. Hard at the notice and squinting. I discovered I couldn't understand a word of it. Okay. Aha. Oops, so let's talk to our buddy about it. Nope. Doggone it. Get back in there. Okay, so we can't do anything with that anymore. Can we talk to him about it? Nope. Shoot. <laughs> let's just keep going in and out. Boy, this carpet guy is gonna hate us. Let's see if we can go there. Hello again, Ultar. Praise. Uh. Did you tell me what that sign means? Yeah. It say, "Door stay shut until Brash come back." Aha! Uh -huh, this is new. Okay. What does that mean? Manager buy lovely new toilet brush, leaves it by wash basin for ten minutes, come back, it been stealing. What the heck? Not even out of wrapper. He damn cross. Lock up toilet and say. Nobody use fine pristine toilet until brush given back. We say, uh -huh. what we do till then, eh? He say, cross legs and use superior willpower. And that's what you're hmm. doing? No. Ultar use bucket. Ew. Okay, perfect. See you around, Ultar. Thanks, Ultar. Good fortune follow you, mister. Because I think I know where the toilet brush is. Because I noticed that something in particular editing my last video. Uh, let's take a look at our buddy. Look what he's using to brush the kebabs with. I believe that that is a toilet brush. In the still air, the smell hung around like bad smells do. In the still air, hmm. the smell hung around like bad smells do. Close up, I could see flies love kebabs. Suddenly... I realized the horrific truth. Uh -huh. The guy was basting the kebabs with a toilet brush. Okay, so we can't say anything else to him again. How do we get the toilet brush from him? Hmm. Let's 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 talk to our. Okay, I'll be back. Let's talk to that kid, because he seems to know what's going on with all of this. Okay. Hi, Nijo. Hello again, sir. And how may I help you this time? Who's the guy selling the kebabs? Yeah. Oh, that's Arto. A miserable blighter, to be sure, sir. He doesn't seem very happy. <laughs> Day in, day out, a face like a wet Wednesday. Whatever one of those is. <laughs> Does he speak any English? Not cogently, no. Look, this is going to sound a bit strange, but I need Arto's brush. What? The brush he bastes the kebabs with? Yes. Let me find some dirty postcards for you instead. <laughs> She's using from a friend, and I want to get it back. Perhaps I could help you. Ooh, maybe you could. Maybe? Perhaps? Maybe what? Perhaps what? I do not wish to see mercenaries, sir, but uh, I am a merchant, and merchants trade. Oh, hold on. Well, if you're going to be disagreeable... No, no, you're right. Uh, what would you like? I seem to recall that you have something that might mm -hmm. my I know exactly what it is. Indeed. Mm -hmm. 
fall, don't you? A tiny spherule of form that barely spans my hand, yet promises hours of amusement. If you mean the ball, why don't you just say so? Can I have the ball back, mister? <laughs> yes. All right, here you go. Thank you, sir. People say bad things about Americans, but you're okay in my book. Hmm. What people? What bad things? Never mind that now. Remember the brush? Right, yes, the brush. All you have to do with Arto is be polite. It lightens his day. Hmm. Makes it all worthwhile for him again. How okay. word of Syrian? Arabic. That's what I meant. Simply memorize this phrase. Il ach il kalb. Il ach il kalb. Close enough. Now, go over to Arto and deliver those honey... Hmm. I wonder what they mean. Enough for you. Really? Really? Hmm. What do you know about that couple? Oh, they're American. <laughs> the chap's a little odd. As for the lady, it's hmm. a funny I think we've had this dialogue before. I get the impression she's a lot cleverer than she's letting on. I met an interesting guy earlier, a cab driver. Ah, that would have to be Ultar. Yeah, I'm sure we have talked about it before. Oh, he's not that bad. You know how he speaks in Pidgin English? That's how he speaks in Arabic too. <laughs> okay, uh, get that. See ya. Thank you. Okay, so let's speak the magic words to the kebab guy. I have a feeling that we might not be saying to him what we think we're saying to him. Hello again, sir. Hello. Kebab? Mmm. Yes? Speak the word. Uh, il akul kalb? Filthy. Bad, bad. What? I'll kill you. Whoa. Calm down. I just... Feet, do your thing. Oh my gosh, he's chasing me with a knife. <laughs> Can we go back down? <gasps> Wait, the brush is gone. Oh, okay, hold on. Didn't Nijo help us out here? Did he Did he grab the brush as we were in distraction? I think he did. Nijo. What the heck did you tell me to tell him? Patience, sir. Patience? Patience? I've been chased by a homicidal kebab seller, and you expect me to be patient? But consider, sir, while you were running from the irate art, mm -hmm. irate art wasn't using the brush. Hold on. Are you telling me that I've been used as a diversionary tactic? Yep. Your brush, sir. Sweet. I can't believe that you put me on that kebab seller's death list for a toilet brush. Look, this is on you. Indeed. I'm with Nidra here. Well, no. He's the ITM man. Oh, spare me. <laughs> Alright, let's go. So long, Nijo. Toodle peep, sir. Later. Okay, there we go. We go here. And over here. Back here. He doesn't seem to want to kill us anymore. Which is good. Now let's return the toilet brush. Because that's what you do in point and click adventure games. Okay. Hello again, Ultar. Praise be to Allah. Mm -hmm. I am blessed with your bountiful presence. Indeed you are. Guess what? What does il akal kalb mean? Who teach you that? Najo told me to say it to Arto. And Arto come after you with big knife, yes? Yeah, how did you know? I know Arto. You tell him in bad Arabic that his kebabs made from dog meat. I said he was using... Oh, jeez. No wonder he went crazy. No. Yeah, no, not, not... No. Right. Oh. Uh... Look, I've got the toilet brush back. Mmm. You man of action, of <laughs> Yeah, that's me. Give to managers. Okay. See you around, Ultar. May good fortune follow you, mister. Yes, yes. 
There wasn't much point in when I couldn't speak Arabic. There wasn't much point when I couldn't. He said, "Give to manager," but hmm. Okay, so I can't talk to him, and I can't give it to him. Well, let's, okay, let's try going over here. So I can't interact with him. So let's let's try this. Let's try treating the manager like a <laughs> yeah, like an interaction thing. It wasn't easy getting it back. Hey, keys to the bathroom. The manager took the brush from me, gave me the toilet keys as my reward. Nice. Okay. Manager, he say, bah. Look at state of this. Need much cleaning and detergent before go around my you bend. He said all that? Body language account for much, you know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's get inside. We got the key now. Let's see. I knew the door was locked. I need the key to get in there. Uh, try to think. What's the first game I can think of that had... um? Well, it would use automatically use keys. Maybe Resident Evil Three. Maybe that was that would be a, this would this would predate Resident Evil, I think. Oh, what's this? Hmm. Let's see. Let's go over here. Oh, it's a squatty potty. I hadn't drunk anything since the morning, and I didn't need to use it. Oh, okay, I'll just steal this. <laughs> yeah, oops. Uh, okay, so I took that. Let's see. I played with that, but can I use anything on that? Let's, let's see. Yes, yes. Stop screwing around. Uh... Oh, that's weird. I still have the keys. Can I open this up? Oh, wow. That's convenient. Okay. Okay, I'll just steal all the towels, too. <laughs> oh, boy. Is there anything else I can do in here? Okay, I can't use the squatty potty. I can't do anything there. I think I looked here, and I just kind of look at myself. All right, well, let's go. Let's go. Oh, so the manager is gone now. That's interesting. Okay. So no more interacting with him. Let's just slurp down over here. What is this? Hey, it's a bell. Hello. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> I hadn't come all this way to seek out curios. Okay, fine. Oh wait, can we get the cat to attack the guy? Hold on. Hey. <gasps> Wait, what just happened? What yoink? Yeah, I'm curious what just happened. What did I just get? What is that? Like a like a little statuette or something? Hmm. That's interesting. Hmm. That's very strange. So and it doesn't, I'm trying to think, can we, oh, there we go. Chipped with both arms broken off. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe we should talk to Nijo. Hi, Nijo. Hello again, sir. And how may I help you this time? Is that your father lurking in the back of the stand? He is indeed. A roaring fellow. Ayup's his name. You don't sound like you respect him very much. Don't I? Not only do I respect him, 
I'd rather like him. For all his bluster, we get on very well. Oh, that's nice. Uh, yeah, I should, I should fess up to it. And when my father deals with that feline for breaking it, you can have a Davy Crockett hat. And <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's this? Uh, that is not a good idea. Okay. Okay, so let me have the statue. Okay. See ya. All right, so let's see. What are we going to do with the statue? Let's see if we can blurp around with it a little bit. Uh, can we make a copy of it? No. Uh, can we use the chain on it? Maybe not. Okay. What about this weird messed up thing? The grease paint had hey. Magic. Now it looked like aged marble. Huh. What are we doing? What about this? Maybe not. Okay. This. Maybe not. Wait, what is that? It was a length of coarse gray toweling. Oh right, right. Okay, so now this looks like ancient stuff. So let's go back. Let's go here. And talk to uh, what's her name, Bumblebee. Didn't have anything that I needed. Oh, she's not. Is she not? Oh, there she is. Okay. Hello again, Pearl. Why, hello, George. Hi, Pearl. It's such a pleasure to see you again. Oh, thank you. Let's, let's see. Well, we'll talk to about some stuff. Heavens, yes! What a big man. Very muscular. But you didn't hmm. go for a ride. Why, George? You're absolutely the most. Oh, you mean a taxi ride? No. Dwayne wasn't interested, so it didn't happen. Hmm. Have you had anything from the kebab stand? Yeah. Heavens, no, with my digestion. Okay. Have you ever heard of a hill called the Bull's Head? No. No, I haven't. Is it hmm. nearby? I'm not hmm. sure. Sounds awful romantic. The Bull's Head Hill. <sighs> You said that your company is based in Akron. And Dwayne said it's in Cleveland, no doubt. Well, yes, he did. Dwayne was in the Marines and Vietnam, you know. Anyway, he got a medical discharge. Thing is, he gets confused. We moved away from Cleveland five years ago. Hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean... That's... Gets a little paranoid. Thinks he's a spy or something. Uh... Don't worry yourself. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That's curious. Do you know what ill occult cald means? Ma, sounds romantic. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think it is, though. No. Okay, so that's. I've got to go now, Pearl. It's been a pleasure, George. Hold on. Oh, wait, I want to talk to her one more time. Why hell? Uh, can I show her? What do you think of this fine piece of ancient statuary? Um, yeah. Just what I've been looking for. Would you like it? Would I ever? I'm not carrying the money, though. If you go and find Dwayne, he'll pay you for oh, it. Oh, okay. If he gives you any trouble, just tell him that I want it. Well, all right, then. Thanks. I gotta go now, Pearl. Thanks, Pearl. It's been a pleasure, George. Indeed. Don't be a stranger. Okay, you weirdo. The merchant was selling fruit. No, I didn't want that. I might have some later. No, I want to talk to... There we go. I gotta click on his head. Hi there, Dwayne. Hi, hi, Dwayne. How can I help you, young fella? Uh, I will you ask about a couple things. Almost luxurious air-conditioned taxi ride, Mister. Yeah, the cabbie. Yep. Right to pull a bunco on us. Take a bunco. Goose chase off into nowhere. Hmm. Have you ever heard of a hill called the Bull's Head? Can't say as I have. Where's that? I don't know. Hmm. Out. Bull's head, huh? I must remember that. Sounds scenic. Hmm. Have you had any dealings with the kebab seller? Absolutely not. Pearl's already had one attack of Montezuma's revenge. No. By the way, that's not Montezuma's revenge is from Mexico, you dork. What do you think of this? Good gravy. Looks old. Yeah. I had to turn this town upside down. Boy, your luck's better than ours. Looks Roman. I wouldn't know. What'll they say back home? How much do you want, George? Oh, I couldn't. It's the. <laughs> I mean, 50 bucks. Deal. Take it or leave it. Take it. I'll take it. Here you go. <laughs> and here you.
you go. Thanks for the money, Dwayne. Thanks. Come in real handy. I ought to be thanking you for finding this Roman statuette. Well. Wow. Okay, well, I'll see you around, Dwayne. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I... <laughs> so we're going to go back over here. Hey, buddy, hope you're not mad at me. And we're going to head into the club and see if we can give the 50... That 50 bucks will take us to Bull's Head from the cab driver. But we're going to do that next time. Thanks for watching this play through of Broken Sword. Shadow of the Templar. Coming up next, we walk through a door. Maybe take a cab. I'll see you then.